What's up, everybody? Back with another pickup video. Tons of shit. Not enough space. We're fucked. All right. Uh, I don't know what to start with. I told you he was a pack rat. <laughs> Not a pack rat. It's just I don't want to sell the shit too cheap and get fucked. Why well, get fucked when I could get money? Uh, yeah. Let's just start with this box of shit right here in front of me. Stopped at a garage sale. Lady had a bunch of shirts and random shit. Got Mr. Good Wrench Button. Got this Oldsmobile. Mm, what is that? A belt oh, buckle. buckle. A couple keychains. They're like for a Cadillac dealership in Port Ritchie. Beautiful Port Ritchie. Uh, I think these are like her uncle's shirts or something. They're all fucking like car related. I'm not a vehicle man. I, don't, I really don't give a shit about that stuff. I know a lot of people do. Some are cool. Like, this one's got all GTOs on it. There's, like, two that are like that. You see that one? Yeah, it's beautiful. Yeah. These are all 50 cents a piece. And all of them have the tags cut out, which is just great. I didn't yeah, notice that. you have to guess the sizes. And I think they're all larges. One does have a tag. I really don't feel like showing all these off. Here's a bike for one. Bike week in Laconia, New Hampshire. I wonder if that's near Daniel. I'll throw those over here. And another bike week one. I got an empty spot over here. Hell yeah, dude. Another Where the Pontiac. fuck do you sleep on that bed? <laughs> Just move the shit from the floor to the bed. Great. And vice versa. Hey. Uh, yeah, all that was like, like nine bucks for all the shirts and then the buns and crap. This was sales from two weeks ago. Yeah. Did we show those? No. Oh. This is when I went like all the way up to like Beacon Woods and shit. Beautiful Hudson, Florida. Uh, this was the one dude had a sale. It was all like quarter shit. It was great. So I got that at the sale. This, this was at like a little like side of the street like flea market thing that people are having. Yeah, it's starting to pop up all over the place since, because it, since all the other flea markets are closing. We got Morris so. and the cat glasses and the original foam mailer. Very cool. Oh. Got some other crap from that. Dude. I've been feeling like shit lately. But I'm, I'm COVID free because I went and got a COVID test the other day. Yeah. Hey. It's a shame. Shit. I could have used the two fucking weeks off. I'm trying to find all the crap from that dude with the Morse the Cat thing. This is the other thing I got off the Morse the Cat dude. It's a cool Phillies puzzle that has. Oh, whoa, whoa. You know, Show me it. Um, Gene Garber, Steve yeah. Carlton, Jim yeah. Cott, and Tug McGraw. Hey. Am I right? Yes, you are. Yeah. Because that was my team in the 70s. Damn right. Another Morse the Cat item. That's dope. A little, a little like note board. I forget what we spent there. Probably like 10 bucks or something. Yeah. The stupid shit he won like a million dollars for, but then like the cool shit like this, he won like nothing for. And he got, he, I think he got it wrecked because he was spending money. Yeah. Because nobody's spending money. This is at the there. quarter sale. It's a Mickey Mouse thing. I thought this was like, like, uh, that's yeah. just like paper. I thought it was like actually print on the glass. It's like carnival glass shit, but it's bullshit. Is that another sale? It's NCAA 91 basketball. I just got it because it has a Pizza Hut logo on it. And it's a little mini basketball. Oh, that was the lady who told us about um, yeah that other flea market. What was it? Gun Highway? Yeah, Gun, Gun Highway closed Highway down. Gun Highway market closed. It's another major. Well, it wasn't a major. This is a decent size. Decent size, yeah. All right. They're all closing down. There's two of these. They're like little cocktail shaker things, and they're Tambay Lightning. I don't feel like it's got a little like goalie helmet on it. And there's like five of these. Final Four 2019 Women's. Women's? Yeah. Oh, good luck. <laughs> they're a quarter each. Yeah. So. Well, they're they're brand them. new. They still got the... Yeah. Price tags and yeah. everything on them. You put them on for a dollar, you probably won't fucking sell them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got 
some reason he had like a bunch of Ford's Garage and some other restaurant like worker shirts. I'm like, what the fuck? It's like the one only one he had left. It's a fucking size small. So <coughs> good luck selling that. Mm. Got a bunch of DVDs. This sale inside the people's house, they, they like fucking didn't speak any English. It was very tough. But I got two Yes DVDs. I think I have this one. I don't think I have this one. They're only like a buck a piece. Just hearing noises. Something barking or yapping. Those are a buck each. Mm, are these all one sale? No. That's all one sale. There's another matter. sale. Yeah, I try to keep it together though. Was it? Uh, these DVDs. Yeah, these are like five bucks. I think I gave the lady. Got Alfred Hitchcock Presents Season One. Got Archie Bunker's Place Season One. They only release Season One on DVD, so that's all you get to enjoy. I think there's like four seasons of this shit. Shit. Fritz the Cat, classic. Uh, Stephen King's The Langoliers, The Stand, and Golden Years. Oh, I've never seen any of this, so we'll check them out eventually. Uh, a salute to Hee Haw. Hee 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 Haw Haw. That's horrible that you even know that. Uh, what are these? I got these just because they're sealed. Rick Steves Europe Complete Collection 2016. That one's travel skills on a creation mission one. Ooh. This person's sale, they had these for 50 cents a piece. Are you sure they're 50 cents? Yeah, I can tell by the giant sticker. Giant around. stickers. Yay. Uh, is that Chillers? Anthony Perkins hosted? I don't know. With the giant blue sticker. We got William Peter Blady's The Exodus 3. Dope movie. And we got the classic Robert Downey Jr. film, Heart and Souls. I love this movie. It's one of my favorites. Then got a couple hats to it's end even that. Even better than The Avengers. <laughs> got this Max Goof hat from... Disney's World on Ice. We got this just Mickey Mouse one. And then we got Daffy. Those are all like, I think 50 cents a piece. Yeah. I hear the, from the, do with the Morris the Cat shit. You know, Philly's Keychain oh, yeah. from 83. And then a Philly's Patch. Oh, some other patch inside. I don't know what it is. Yeah. It's open now. Oh, that's cool. National League Centennial. Oh. Huh. 1976. That's dope. Why are there so many birds outside? I don't know. They're out to get you. <laughs> it's 87 today, and it's supposed to be going down to 73 well, tomorrow. This isn't a pickup, but... They got Fruity Pebbles chocolate bars, which are fucking delicious as hell at Walmart. So I highly recommend these. I've eaten two of these so far. Because I'm fat. No, you're not. That's fine. I'm big bone. Yeah. Alright. I don't know. I'll show this shit. Bought some autographs over the past couple of weeks because I like wasting my money on shit. Yeah, Steven Root autograph. Who? Plays Milton in Office Space. Dude, the stapler. Angus Scrim from Phantasm. Who? Anthony Michael Hall. I know him. He was in the Batman movie. Yes, he was. And he's going to be in the new Halloween movie. I don't care. And Tommy Lee Wallace from Halloween. He, like, created the Michael Myers mask and directed Halloween 3. So. Wow. Well, yeah. Lucky. Thanks, man. Uh, oh yeah <sighs> i actually found some stuff in the trash yeah it's kind of when i get out to help and there everything is let's go in the dan box dan box dan oh daniel o'day that found a bunch of loose disc shitty xbox games i was gonna say you might as well turn this off because i didn't find any games but they're all they're all scratched yeah. to shit but i don't know if they'll ever work yeah battlefront star wars halo 2 Nightfire 007, NFL Street 2, NFL Street, SSX3, SSX Tricky. Yeah. There, there, there's nothing amazing yeah, here. Uh, Why didn't you show the games? 
Yeah. You got games at home. Look at those. Yeah. And there's no fucking boxes, so why even bother? Exactly. Who cares? This is in the garbage, too. Because I get out and help. Uh, and there's a stabilizer the kit. Sewing crap. Sewing crap. It's still sealed. So hopefully you can make some out. Oh, yeah. This is in the garbage, too. They found some VHS tapes. This is the only one that didn't have, like, any mold on it. Path of the Dragon, Bruce Lee. What would I bring home, like, 20 tapes and all of them had fucking mold? Yeah, they're, like, beyond Jesus repair mold-wise. They're good titles, too. But... Oh, yeah, also from that garage sale week. Not those. You got some records. Uh, got a bunch of these Star Trek. They're all the same, but they're still sealed. Star Trek read-along ones. There's, like, five of those. And then there's a Superman. There's three different Superman ones, and there's quantity of each one. I'm going to pay, like, 30 bucks for all these, I think. Yeah, it's like a buck and a half a piece. Beautiful artwork. <laughs> Well, lady had this stuff and then a bunch of shit. <laughs> yeah, I didn't yeah, understand why she had this why, stuff at all. Yeah. I mean, also at Walmart, I had this for 40 bucks, so I bought it for myself, the Fly Collection. Artwork's dope. I only watched the first one so far, and not the Cronenberg one. The old one? Yeah, the one with like, Vincent Price. Oh, it's the only oh, one I watched man. so far. I'll get around to watching the other ones. Oh, my foot is asleep like hell. Mm. <sighs> it's over here so i could trip leave in this place yeah sorry i'm so nasally just feeling like shit but i don't have corona god damn it he's very upset about that i went two weeks off fucking pissed what's next i don't know here, show him off. Oh, yeah. Throw him to the side. Hey. I had these at Walmart. I was like, oh, this is adorable. I need them. And so, we bought them. Isn't he cute? You didn't set him up outside this year. He's like more of an inside decoration. Plus, you don't want him stolen. This is true. <coughs> That's my baby. That's why I'm afraid he was set up for Christmas. All right. I need water. We're going to cut to... Moody and D's pickups real quick, and then when we come back, we'll finish this shit. We are? Yeah. So, we'll meet you back. What's up, everyone? These are my power pickups for the month of power pickups. Power. Uh, power pickups. And for these power pickups, Little Jay told me I only could have about three minutes to show off my power pickups. Nothing. Actually, it's some good shit, so I can't say nothing. You know how those... Some of those... YouTubers who, you know, nothing really, you know, big, and then you show like a fucking $500 item and shit. Um, but yeah, these are gonna be like sports cards. I think it's almost all baseball. Um, if you didn't know, I collect sports cards. I've done it for a while before all these motherfuckers decided to do it. Make it really hard to like get them now. I can't even like go to Walmart or Target or anything to even get like the shitty blaster where I always get fucked. I haven't been fucked in a while. Uh, I tried to get fucked recently and I uh, couldn't get fucked. Dined and dined after I've been um, so for a hundred bucks, I got, uh, what is this? Joe DiMaggio, Babe Ruth Relic. Always wanted a Babe Ruth Relic card. Never had one. Been collecting for at least 10 years. I don't think I've ever had a Ruth. So a hundred bucks for these two. The card we got here is also a Babe Ruth card. Uh, what went on like on a Babe Ruth Heights? I saw the movie with John Goodman. We plays the babe. Povesta lui Babe Ruth, John Goodman in mare forma. Dominica, la tevere uno. That is John Goodman. Um, I bought this Babe Ruth, Barry Bonds, uh, Bat Relic card. Uh, if you guys didn't know, Babe Ruth stuff, like his Bat cards, are tend to be on the cheaper side compared to his Jersey cards. It's a product called Leaf, if anyone gives a fuck. And Leaf has a box where, like, you're guaranteed, like, a Babe Ruth back card. So it kind of, like, brought the market down on back cards just because, like, almost, I think every box has one. And it's, like, either it comes with a back card, like, a, a piece of, like, the seat from the Yankee Stadium. I don't know. Who the fuck wants that? Not me. Uh, next, I think I paid 
I want to say $72 for this Fernando Tatis rookie year, uh, rookie insert, Colosso, jumbo jersey card. I looked these up, dude. I didn't know like National Treasure baseball like comps were like this stupid, but the comps on this were just dumb as fuck, so I bought it. Next, I have a Babe Ruth Mickey Mantle uh, top T206 uh, jersey bat. Uh, I think Topps did the T206 series. I think they only did it once. I don't think it really, uh, I don't think it did well. I remember the autographs in here just being total ass. Like I kept seeing Marlon Burns. Uh, if you didn't know, he was actually an all-star in the Cubs and we traded his fucking bum ass. And, I, and so we got Kyle Hendricks, believe it or not. Um, but really cool card. You gotta hurry up. Cause you know, little Jay gave me three minutes. He said, don't go over the three minute mark. Next, we got a Dirk Nowitzki auto. Uh, love Dirk, you know, gotta love him. How do you not like Dirk? You know, people say I look like him. I, I, you know, I don't see it. I mean, we both ugly as fuck, but you know, I think he's a little more on the ugly side. I bought this app, a dude with zero feedback. He shipped it in an iPhone box, iPhone box. So just a little like weird. Um, uh, last card we have here is a PSA 9 DeAndre Ayton uh, auto. I think this guy's a stud. I. He's already good as fuck. I think he's on the cheaper side. I paid, I think, 50 bucks for this. I'm not sure, but I think it was 50. Buy this motherfucker. This motherfucker is going to be really fucking good, even better than he is. Those are my um, power pickups of power for the month of power with the week of power pickups. Uh, if you like this, you know, just leave in the comments. Jerome, give D more the time than three fucking minutes. Give me three fucking minutes. I could have explained more details about these players and about these cards, but, you know... Couldn't do it. I hope you power the power, and we're going to go back to Jerome, and he's going to show his power, power of the week of power, pick of power. All right. So you saw Moody's and D's pickups. Hope you enjoyed those. If you want more of that, fuck it. We'll just, we're just going to keep doing whether you like it or not because D's retired. I keep saying that whenever I talk to him. He's retired. Uh, let's retired do that. from what? YouTube. Oh. He's retired. Went to the record store. I was looking because he put the record dude posted that a guy like a couple copies of the new of the Crow soundtrack on vinyl, which the record store release is like $150 and they just reissued it again, so mm. dropped the value. It's the same exact fucking album. But he sold out right away. But I ended up picking up some other crap that I needed. I got this John and Vangelis, the Friends of Mr. Cairo album. I actually had this already, but not this cover art. It's going to look nice autographed. It will. When we, we see John him. again. If we ever meet him. Got Gary Newman, Telecon. Whenever I see... I always see this album, but I see, like, the reissues of it. I don't want a fucking reissue. I want a, an original press of it, not fucking brand new shit. This is brand new shit, because I'm not going to pay, like, 50 bucks and up. But I got Beastie Boys Hello Nasty. It's one I've been wanting. I actually want all the BC Boy albums on vinyl, so I already have five Burrows and Licensed Hill, so I need to get that one next. All right. We're going to end this on Dan's Package. You're already wearing something from Dan's Package, Bohemian Rhapsody sweater, hoodie thing. Well, it's not, no, it's well, not, it's a, not hoodie, a hoodie. Because it doesn't have the hood. I'm a fucking moron. This is all this past weekend's garage sale shit. Who the hell would even fucking wear this? Uh, I don't know. I would never wear this outside the house. Because then you'd have to deal with people and... Do you know it, Queen? Yeah. I thought I'm in concert back in the 80s. I don't care. I don't give a shit. Why are you talking to me? Uh, is that one sale? This lady had a few cool... I got like a little airplane thing off her. Cocaine? Cocaine? It's a little bag. She said she got it in like... Where'd she get? Korea? No. Bangkok, Bangkok. Oriental City. Bangkok. Yeah, she said she got in Bangkok when she was traveling there. It's a cool, like, promotional item. I love stupid shit like that. I only wear basic black shirts when I leave the house. Yeah. He, That's it, because I don't want any interaction. I used to wear my Batman shirts out, and then I'd have fucking people just running up to me and wanting to start the conversation up with me. I, I, you know, I... I hate even going outside. I hate going to fucking work because I got to talk to people. Just leave me alone. Thank you. 
also got this Malaysian Airlines thing. Like you, you stopped wearing like anything. Yeah, with I did. Fucking... I did. I, you can have them. You can have all those shirts and sell them. I don't give a fuck. Yeah, it's a airplane. Malaysia Airlines. Just, just put it on eBay. Is this is my dad's shirt? I'm doing him a favor by selling it and getting rid of it out of his life. Because he doesn't want interaction with humans. Yeah, I remember he used to wear Batman oh, shirts. Oh, I used to then... love it, man. And then people just come up and talk to me. That, that, yeah. that one fucking dude at the mall just scared the fuck out of me. Like, I could see him out of the corner of my eye just fucking running towards me. Because I had a Batman shirt. I got... And then, I, I said this in one of the previous videos. He just comes up and he's like, I got the same shirt at home. I don't fucking care. I don't care. Jesus Christ. He could probably have the same fucking underwear on as I do. I don't care. Go. Uh, these are all on sale. We got this cool Kodak <laughs> fucking ice bucket. <laughs> it's, it's cool. It's stupid and unique. I love it. Would it make you laugh? Yeah. I <laughs> uh, got this Sopranos promotional trash can. I don't know why this was made. Like... I don't the know. fuck does that have, have to do with I, Sopranos? Call your brother and ask. <laughs> Trash can. Uh, ask your brother. I have no uh, this this might be this is a contender for final of the day. <laughs> along with that, you felt weird buying this, uh, didn't you? Oh yeah, because I didn't want the person to see what I was buying. Yeah, you're gonna masturbate to it anyway. Nah. So what does it matter? Dirty Bob's Excellent Adventures <laughs> Volume Twenty Three, Tampa Teasers Part Due. It was filmed down here, so maybe you can watch it. And See if you know, yeah. recognize any I mean, like, <laughs> You can do a filming location video. <laughs> 27 adult video stars. Five days, three limos. Tampa was great, but Sarasota sucked. Adults only VHS not rated 60 minutes long. My God. I could probably get through about three minutes of it. Then oh, I'm yeah. Gonna, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Oh, this was the same as the fucking Malaysia oh, airline lady. That doesn't matter. Uh, Johnny Cash movie? The Baron and the Kid. I don't know, it looked weird. Is and, it Johnny Cash? And Ted Bundy. Is it <laughs> the, actually Johnny Cash? Yeah, it's Johnny, the Johnny yeah. Cash logo? Oh, wow. And June Carter Cash. Oh, whatever. That's fucking, that's Johnny Never Cash. Heard of it. The only thing I like Johnny Cash in was Columbo. Great episode. Then this is all that dude sale. The weird dude? Yeah. We walk into this guy's fucking... He has a giant, giant trailer. Yeah. Mobile home. And he has his giant sunroom on the side. It's fully just filled with shit. Fully enclosed with screen. And what are the first words out of his mouth? Never get married. Says it to him. Never get married. Because his, his, his woman's just uh, yapping. And like Just, yelling yeah, at him and bullying him. <laughs> it's funny. Hope the sex is worth it, buddy. I bought an empty Pringles can for a dollar because it's old school and like it's awesome. It's Pringles. Look at that, look at that little dude. I offered the guy a dollar for it. It was filled with buttons, yeah, Girl but... Scout buttons, which were they weren't anything. And the only button that's left in there has a smiley face he left on. Me a smile. He left us a smiley face. I, I told I go give you a dollar for this. And he just, he took the lid off and dumped the fucking, <laughs> dumped the goddamn pins all over the place. And he, yeah, take it for a dollar. I got this Opryland little souvenir cup. And then this is one that I wanted. So I just bought both. Chicago Bulls, three-time championship. It's pretty cool. Oh, I think there's like another. Oh, yeah, there's another cup. Another Opryland. So I got two. Wow. Little, little bonus deal. Who the fuck's gonna buy those? I don't know. There's a fucking. There's a moron to buy anything. Got no, this... no offense in advance, morons. <laughs> there's two whack a mole games. They still work. I actually, I remember these as a kid, but oh, I never had one. Shit. Well, now you have one. Now I, two. I know. Now I can play with a friend. <laughs> Got some comic bags because that's true. All my friends live on the internet. Or an hour away from me. <laughs> what was in this bag? Oh, uh, this. I yeah. just saw because I noticed like this, like the little shirt area. I'm like, that's fucking Michael Jackson. I'm gonna pay like two bucks for this. Yeah. I didn't even look at like anything in it besides. It's like a Michael Jackson. Right. Oh, 3D sticker. 
Can I get that? Can I catch? There we go. Michael! There's like three or four of these in here. Yeah, that's cool. So, oh, they're all different. Different shirt. Yeah, that one's the same. But that one's got his thriller jacket. Or yeah. yeah. I didn't even look at anything else in no. here. Rainbow disc. Oh, I'll go through it later. Yeah. It's a, it's not important to me right now. How's everybody's uh, day going? How was Halloween? Yeah, how was Halloween? We had 10 trick-or-treaters? Yeah. That's about it. Yep. Oh, yeah, this was also at the sale with the, the man mutant. with the grumpy. Yeah, the mutant, we call him. <laughs> it's a sprout flashlight. Oh, but I'm blinding by there. That's fine, though. Come on, fucker. Turn it off. There we go. <sighs> <laughs> no wonder you sold it to us. It won't shut off. Pre-ordered this a few months back. <coughs> so I can get it autographed eventually at a convention. Joe Bob Briggs action figure. See, he's a decent human being because he only charges 10 bucks when you bring your own item to get signed. Really? Yeah. That's why I spent like 40 bucks with him at the last wow. time I met him. So I got a bunch of shit signed. Joe Bob. Oh, yeah, that's shit, too. These are all in the garbage. garbage. Stupid hats. Yay, garbage. Tampa Bay uh, Lightning. All in one pile from one house. Bunch of Florida Gator champion hats. I can give a shit about college sports. I don't see the the hype in it. Rays oh, lost. Yeah, they did. There's a Buccaneers hat. That's a championship hat. Yeah, when they won the, the bowl of supers. Yeah. A gator you know, you hat. know why they won that year? Gator hat. I don't know. Because who, the, Eagles, the Eagles underestimated them the week before. Ah, That's why. I the Eagles know. were too busy on the phones making flight reservations and hotel reservations down here. Oh, yeah. I got or wherever the fuck it was. Oh, man, Here's man. some more loose discs that Dad found in the trash. Sim City 2000, Croc, Spyro. Spyro, Ripto's Rage, and Tyco RC. Doesn't matter. Really doesn't. I got these at the dollar store because dollar store has like decent movies. It's got Death Wish 2, 3, and 4. What happened to 1? I don't know. They don't have the rights to put that on a shitty dollar store disc. And then Tim and Eric's billion dollar movie. Who? They're funny. Oh, well, I don't know if you'd like this movie. It's pretty, There's some pretty like weird comedy. But it's still funny and hilarious. Uh, I'll do these second to last. All the buttons and shit I bought. Oh, you got this crap here. <laughs> oh, yeah. You get too much shit. I can't believe I this. this is going to be like an eight minute video. <laughs> How the fuck do you end up with so much shit? <laughs> <laughs> we just fucking filmed, man. How do you get so much shit? I don't know. And look at this. Who the fuck would make... Who would buy this? This guy. Who would fucking buy this? This was three dollars. It was worth every penny I had. Should I film the rest of the video with this all in my head? Uh, well, we'll see how sweaty I got. It was three dollars. You should have seen. Now all I can the say it's a buck's life. You should have seen all the buccaneer <laughs> shit this guy was selling. It was insane. Yeah, this uh, Lego Batgirl plushie. It's actually cool. It's like a dollar. Got these hats. They're a buck a piece. Angels and the Nuggets. I think this is at the same sale. Yeah. It was a buck? Yeah. Yeah, it was a buck. Uh, Ashtray for a quarter. How like, much was it? It was a quarter. Are you sure? Uh, Can you read the giant fucking price sticker they have on it? Uh, yes, yeah. I'm bitching. Uh, <laughs> just make a quarter table and a dollar table. Yeah. If you got stuff that you want to get real high price, then price that. Got a Max Scherzer bobblehead. Who? He's a starting pitcher for the Nationals. He's yeah. it's pretty good. Where were they this year? I don't know, man. The season doesn't count. I know. Got a class of 1984 on DVD. It was like a dollar fifty at some lady's sale. I mean, this is at the same sale as those hats. That was a dollar. RoboCop Steelbook. Oh yeah. Okay, this lady, uh, she is probably fucking nuts or something. Yeah. According to her, all these games 
Well, first off, these are a quarter each. Quarter each. So right there, she's nuts. Yeah. Second she of had, all, she had boxes and boxes and boxes. Uh, all these apparently belong to uh, Ryan Howard of the Philadelphia Phillies organization. Those in the DVDs too. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, siphon filter, dark mirror for the PSP, ratchet and clank size matters. Still sealed. Sealed. You got Mario Kart on the Wii. Resident Evil Nemesis for the PS1. Two copies of Motorstorm sealed for a quarter and resident evil code veronica x on the ps2 i think that's it. oh god these fucking buttons oh, god. this video won't end sorry everybody <laughs> <laughs> all right this lady had a bunch of fucking disney pins i like not buying disney pins at garage sales because they're like fucking 15 dollars when you go to disney and yeah. fuck that shit yeah, rock and roller coaster. You can pull the pit, the guitar pick out of that. You can. Too. Expedition Everest. I think it's supposed to be like a bellhop outfit for a. Uh... Can't think of it right now. That's that's a cool. That's like the one that I want, haunted mansion one. Mm. What is this one? Flower and Garden Festival. She had a fuck ton of buns. I just picked out some dope ones. Maleficent. If you had somewhere to set up, I would have just said yeah. buy them all. Happy Halloween 2015. She says she <laughs> wanted like 50 cents to a dollar. You could have just offered her 50 cents for all of them. I can't think of the bird's name. It's Gilbert Godfrey, though. Milagro? Milagro? I don't know. Oh, it was a stupid movie. <laughs> it's Aladdin. You don't like anything. There's Aladdin and Genie. Everything. You do hate everything. It's coming with Fucking age. Beaker, man. The Beak. <laughs> Uh, yeah, let's do these, and then put it down. Oh, I'm not gonna... I got more buttons. Oh, First one, even... I'll just Christ. show off the cool one. Yeah, Gorf. Poof. Gorf, Space Cadet. Mass of the Universe button. I love buttons. Another Talking Heads one. This one's actually in better condition. I forget what else is in here. The fuck's that? Asbury. Southside Johnny. Graham Parker. Uh, they're like fucking... When, when you're paying like less than a quarter. Doesn't matter. God, this hat is annoying my nose. Oh, yeah. I want this lot. This lot I paid like a dollar for just to get this NBA Jam pin. It's fucking awesome. Yeah, there's more here. I just... Nothing like amazing. Ball. Alright. Last thing. The package from day. Don't be leaning out. There's records in there. I know. I'm not putting all my weight on it. How do we know? You dick. Stop yelling at me. Uh, did a trade. Uh, six month trade in the making because I'm a lazy fuck to go through garbage pail kid cards from my boy Daniel O'Day of Rebel Gaming Club. Rebel Rebel Gaming Club. Is that an autographed copy? Yes, it is. Oh my fuck. You know. He doesn't sign them all. You gotta basically ask for a signature, and then you'll get this. So he threw this in because I I mentioned it, how like I loved it, and some it's, it's amazing because of how cheesy it is. But we also got Bob Star, his new single. Well, not it's not a single, it's a whole fucking album. I'm stupid. Signed by him. It's amazing. Bubblegum Pop. Contact him if you want a copy. Ten bucks. Ask him to sign it. Or else you just get a fucking just get this and it's not signed on his on his cock area. <laughs> he also sent some other stuff that I worked on. The mock title. There's there he is. Look at him. Jesus Christ. I know he lost. Fuck? He used to drink. He was a heavy drinker. I'm proud of you, Daniel. This is like his solo work, I think. Mock title. It's not autographed. It's not. He he fucked up on that one. River City Rebels. I think it's just like a little sampler. He knows I collect the his shit. This is like these were the big items that I wanted. He got these at a fucking thrift store, which I was very jealous of. They may yeah, they might be giant self title album. It's got Dumb Let's Start, which is their best song ever. I saw them live, awesome concert, and they didn't play that song. I was upset. Didn't they? They did not. They oh played like God. everything else but Don't Let's Start. They like, played that stupid song that you like. 
played Istanbul. Yeah, that's it. And then we got our album Lincoln. I don't really know shit off this album, but oh, I, I wanted it. I wanted it. I'll listen to it over and over again. He sent this because it's another album I didn't have, but he, he said knowing that there's a giant chunk missing out of it. So I won't be able to listen to the first song, but that's fine. It's a place filler till I find an actual non-broken copy. Son of a bitch, you should have signed it, Dan. Could have signed it in the back. I Look know. at all that white room back I there. know. What the fuck, Dan? Now I gotta like, now I gotta schlep that up to too many games next time. <laughs> and now we got Partridge Family. Because me and Dan have been watching the Partridge Family. i talking about it. He stopped watching like season three. I'm on season four still. He was inspired over the quarantine. Bubblegum Pop. Partridge Family. Castles. All that fun stuff. Go Castles. check out yeah, go check out Dan's channel, Rebel Gaming Club. You should already know. I always put his fucking link at the end for some reason. Uh yeah. Nobody, wa nobody watches his shit either, so. <laughs> nobody watches anybody's shit. Nobody, yeah. Uh yeah. I noticed I noticed that they're slowly declining. What are people doing? Oh. I mean, I'm jerking off, so I got an excuse. I don't check this shit out. I'm the person that's watching all these stupid fucking videos. <laughs> you are. Got my playlist set up. Just... You got a fucking TV. It never goes on. It never turns on. No, I just watch on the computer. It's... Yeah. Sir, I got ad block. I'm not letting these people get my money. <laughs> You're going to turn that TV on. There's going to be smoke from all the dust. <laughs> it's going to be burning off. It goes on for Rebel Rocket League Monday, and that's about oh, it. Oh, God. So, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that motherfucking notification bell if you want more fun pickups. Look how big this thing is. I know. It's like a blanket on you. Not on you, though. <laughs> no, man. It's skin tight on me. Oh, Christ. <laughs> I'm a big boy. I'm a, I'm a husky gentleman. Husky. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. 34 minutes. Peace, love, dope. <sighs> Turn evil. Turn <laughs> evil.